Hello, hello, Blue Swami here, and welcome back to another episode of Obscurity. And picking up where we left off last time, um, full disclosure, I actually tried recording a minute ago, forgot to change the screen, and uh, uh, we filled out the uh, kill quota here, just turned this in not even two minutes ago, so uh, you'll see this in my inventory, I went with the full heart here. Um, we could repeat this one, do no okay on bone meal, so I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, this quest unlocked the gun control, so we'll get into this, get that created here in a moment. Uh, hopefully, and the bow down. It'll be a bronze reinforced bow. I don't have any, uh, don't have any alloys going yet, so uh, I'll get on that here soon. Um, dug down to the silver and gold uh, between episodes, and uh... But then realized I had a flint pickaxe, couldn't get the uh, ore like I needed to get. So uh, we're, we'll be working towards that today as well. Uh, Unearth the Darkness, um, dug a hole over to the market, was farming up some cotton and some string for uh, the bag here. Uh, looking into this, I gotta get some blaze rods to get into the potion of swiftness, it looks like. Uh, we'll probably be doing this one today, possibly this one, and. Uh, if not this one, then probably this one, the uh, Traveler's Wings. So we'll, we'll go through some of that here in a bit. And yeah, we're already done with that. Forge the Darkness. Got to make all these. And I went ahead and smelted up a whole lot of these. What else? And Tower Defense. We'll try to get in some more of this. I got the Spiky Wood to complete. Uh, I got the iron spikes, and we'll try to get onto the uh, the uh, the torches today as well. So, uh, first things first. I think we'll run over to the market real quick. I'll show you what I've done. Um, I just dug a hole. See, also I got a little spot here. Kind of dug out some of this area. Um, made a beacon for the spawn, got one for the market, and went ahead and mopped the, my, mapped the icy, um, small world thing, whatever, condensed world, and then, uh, dug a hole, kind of mostly over to spawn, just in case, uh, also did some other work that I'll show you here in a moment, I don't think I had it done, uh, before last episode. So I got ourselves a fairly safe uh, underground tunnel over to the market. There was a couple surprises dug up to the ground, but I had to dig around and let's see here. We have ourselves some cursed earth here. And I believe all oh, that's cursed earth. Okay, and we have the market right here. Now that's just dirt. Try to see up in here a little bit. Now I'm getting turned around. Okay. <laughs> cursed earth. <laughs> All right, lots of cursed earth. That's just fine. Trying to make sure I don't dig anything out and then get swarmed. Uh, I think we'll be okay. I see a redstone torch in there, but it looks just for like lighting purposes. So what is up on top of that? I cannot see. Uh, 
Oh well. Hi, Scaly. It looks like obsidian, I think. Obsidian or something like that. I'm going to try to go in. I may regret this immensely. Hopefully not. But if I die... Oh wow, pretty big. Huh. Carpenter's blocks... Can't see... Okay, that's a grass block. Alright. Oh, I like that. Huh. Yep. Huh. <clears throat> hmm. Exactly. Oh yeah, I'll go ahead and eat this as well. And we're gonna put a couple things in here. No, no, I'm not. <laughs> That's pretty full. Okay. So we can get the written book for Emerald, and that can unlock some more stuff. I'll work on that, I guess, in a bit. <laughs> so we made it to the market. I'm going to check on out of here. Please put me where I want to be. Yes. Whew. And I'll figure out a plan for this cursed earth as well. How to get a hold of it. For now, we'll head back. Oh, and book. I guess we visited, so. No, no. Not visited, seven meters away. Two meters away. See that count? <laughs> nope, didn't count. Should be okay for a second here. Yay! And we got it. <laughs> Alright, I'll look at that here in a second. That should be okay. And I'm going to block that up for now. Okay. Back to the main base. So we got the market visited. We have a, excuse me, we have a, oh, hi. Oh, oh. Uh. Joker. <laughs> Yay for vampirism. I'm assuming that's what that was. I guess I should have just shot him. Let's see, any friends here? Yep. Uh. Uh. 
He's taking all the hits to the face. Oh, jeez. Where'd you come from? Okay, did I screw up with anything? Oh. Spawner. Well, I shouldn't be a spawner this far away. Must have been something else. Okay, Skelly coming. We'll take care of him real quick. Get all the drops. So here's what I worked on in between episodes. I've got everything kind of fenced off. Fairly safe. There's a couple ways to get in. Sometimes the skeletons can figure it out. So you can kind of slip through right here. Grab stuff and slip back in. There's just a couple places like that you can get in and out. Um, looks like the skeletons are spawning off my gravestones, but I'm going to leave that for now just to kind of farm them. They don't really bother me for the most part. And it seems like they're um, unarmed. At least for the most part, so I'm not too worried about it. So yeah, spawn tower and a nice clean path to get back over here to the main area I've been working. Getting some trees, smelting them up for charcoal. Um, always replanting. A um, couple furnaces. Like I said, been smelting some stuff up. Charcoal, of course. Throw this in here. We'll use it in a moment. I ended up getting a grindstone as I got uh, a bunch of quartz, so I went ahead and made one of those. Ground up some uh, iron, some copper as well. So worked on that a little bit off camera to get ready for the episode. I don't remember where this came from. And I don't think I made it. So, yeah, grindstone, got that going, and farming up some... Uh, slime balls as these guys are relentless hey look at this inventory cleaned up here no we don't wanna <laughs> don't wanna dehydrate that or try that whatever you wanna call it we got a bunch of slime balls at this point. Let's see, good. A couple of those. Um, I'll hold on to the string. Bone meal I'll throw in there. Rotten flesh. Bones. More rotten flesh. Get that back away. Throw that and that in there. Oh, a lot of string. Excellent. I'm going to take that string for now. Light gruel. <laughs> Light gray wool slab. I'll throw it over in here. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. <laughs> okay. So I know we'll need this. Um, I'll take some of these. What else do we need? Go ahead and get some iron. And I'll get some redstone as well. Portable tank, I'll leave it there for now. I know we'll need that in a minute, though. 
Um, and let's go ahead and look at this. So we can get an emerald, emerald ore, or magmatic florb. Liquefied emerald. Emerald. Hmm. I don't even know what that is. Magmatic Florb. Okay, so... We do this. <laughs> Get to the emerald. It's iron, okay. Emerald. So, what do you do with it? <laughs> That's the question, I guess. I mean, I see how to make it and everything, but what do you do with it? Okay, thermal expansion. Let's look up that. These are things. You can throw it. Okay. And then what? I'm so confused. <laughs> um, I feel like I should get it, but I don't know. Well, we can get emeralds fairly easily, it looks like, from the market. So uh, I guess I'll go with the, the floor. <laughs> I don't know. I may regret it. I don't know. <laughs> it's a little hard to tell. Okay, let's go ahead and eat this sucker up. And we'll look at this guy real quick. Um, making our little spot. Kind of like having them up here right now. Check this one out. It's a tiny one. So both those are tiny. Oh, I think I had a little bit of lag there. Alright, that's okay. So how do you tell... How would you tell if you could pick it up? Without losing everything. Ah, the upgraded, okay. Zero, twelve, thirteen. Huh. Okay. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I need a two. Prepare this, uh, little shovel real quick. Alright, and let's do some work now. Apologies for the cold, but fighting off a sinus infection, got the sniffles and such. 
Okay, confusing coordinates. You can use your inbuilt mapping system to help find the cubes. Press J and you can create a new waypoint by entering in the coordinates. The values in the quest book are in slightly different order. The book displays the coordinates as X, Y, Z. Once you enter them in, you will see the location of the cube in the world. Remember, the coordinates in the quest book are in the order of X, Y, Z. To use the use of the teleport feature is cheating. Okay. So yeah, I was able to figure that out and got the uh, coordinates all set up for us. Um, let's see, we want a compass real quick. So, I'm assuming still the same. And we'll get a we'll get a bag. And speaking of which, we have I have a couple tucked away. So let's do the reward bag. Let's see what we got. Some grass. What do we get there? Ah, sweet. Some gold. Splash potion of harming. Some gold coins. Looks like all we got. Ah, lovely. Some more coins. Invisibility. And a couple ender pearls. Ender pearls are going to be handy. Actually, I'm going to keep those on me for now. And I think I'll put these up for now. Okay, moving on. Let's work on the white bag. So I need a chest, a little bit of string, a little bit of wool. Looks like we're good. And like so. Now we got to make a void bag. Let's see, black bag, black bag. And void bag. So I need four more wool, four string, and one ender pearl. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, apparently. That's fine. One pearl. One void bag. Everybody's around here, but not in here, thankfully. And we'll get an upgrade. Let's go ahead and open up the bag here. Meat feats pizza. Sounds yummy. I'll actually eat on that for right now. Whoa. <laughs> I'm going to hold on to that for a moment. I'll let the hunger go down a little bit. Since we're crafting. Okay, let me look at this. Um, darkness, discover treasures, bring along, Lord Dusk provided with some very useful bags. Carry around with us. You have two tiers available to you. Also, a void bag that will allow you to trash your unwanted items. Okay, so the upgrade... I'm assuming just makes it a bigger bag. So we get white bag and white bag too. Okay. So it's just a craft thing. Gotcha. Now, there's just one void bag. Yeah, because you're just going to delete everything in the void bag. So I'm going to go ahead and probably put the void bag up. I don't foresee needing it. Um, yeah, it'll be okay. Wool. I'll throw the wool in here. Um, coins, gold. Go ahead and take these. 
Um, string might need. We'll see here. All right, back it on out. Get that lasso. Traveler's wings. Lasso will need blaze powder, which I can't get yet. So let's work on that. Then traveler's wings, bronze. Don't have that yet. Okay. So let's put these up. Actually. I'm gonna Grab these. And actually killed a blizz a little while ago, and I don't know what that's used for. Blizz powder, snowballs, blizz rod, blizz powder, cryothium dust. Okay. So that would be needed later. And that to our grass pile. Let's see, the golden bag. Golden bag of holding will give you a full double chest worth of space to store items. You can rename them in an anvil and also place them inside of each other. Task where the player has to grasp specific items. Okay. We get some gold block. So, that's going to take a little bit. Don't have diamonds yet. Don't have a block of gold yet, I don't think. And I don't have magical wood, so... We'll come back to that. Let's see here. Icy. Okay, that's the next place. Desert. What do you get from that one? Sandstone, niter, cinder pearls. We'll want to go for that. That'll get us... Some blaze powder. Another compact machine. Let's see. Chest companion, the luggage. That'll be good for crafting around here. And meats. We'll need a lot of food. Uh, you can either lay some grass and wait till something spawns, or you can buy some eggs and go from there. Your choice. Tasks where the player needs specific items, these do not have to be handed in. Having them in one's inventory is enough. Okay. So, wolves, ocelots, cows, sheep, pig. Hmm. Man, I'd, I'd like to have one of each at least. <laughs> the wolf could go after the uh, skellies, and the uh, ocelots could keep the creepers away. But I think the creepers going to be one of my hardest. Um, enemies. Since they sneak up on you and all. Okay. And, uh, let me double check this. Alright, we'll come back to this later. Uh, f I think we really need to work on getting smeltery going. So, uh, we'll work our way backwards. So, we'll do the basin, the table, the faucet, the drain, the tank, the controller and then the bricks. Okay. So... Which way is it easier to do? Yeah. Seer bricks. Here we go. So we need the eight, we need the six, the pants, the cauldron, Go ahead and do the tank, maybe some glass. Of course, that one. And some bricks. So, we should be able to knock this out real quick. Um, pants. Um, cauldron. That one. Let's see, what was it? This here for the tank. 
It's a window. Um. Ah, I see. Slightly off. Wow, that was weird. Oh, it didn't make it. Interesting. I thought I did make it. That's okay. Sixteen blocks, and is that it? That is it. Okay, what do we want? We want fancy, we want seared, we want stone, we want seared bricks. I'm tempted to get the stone, in all honesty. Because you can do something with that, can't you? Maybe not. No, we'll just uh go with the simple bricks. Oh, I don't have enough room, I bet. Um, what can we move here? Oh, give me that. Got two of those now. Um, bags, bags, bags. Let's see. Can we do that? We'll throw that in here. That in there. See what can get rid of glass string six wood pizza all right bring the book back down throw the book rather <laughs> come on there we go okay Got that. There we go. Alright. Yeah, we didn't have enough room. So, let's see here. We'll eat the heart. And looking at the time, looks like it's going to be wrapping up. We'll check back in here in a minute. I'll probably go ahead and set this up in between episodes. Get some uh, iron and some other metals going. And I'll check in with you next time. We'll go mining a little bit and take care of some more of these quests. A quick look at what we got coming up. So we unlock some of the stuff here. We'll get the uh, aluminum brass going. Uh, some void, no, not void bags, but um, ender bags, I believe. And yeah, it looks like we're going to get the jet packs and the lava. <laughs> and I peeked at that earlier. That's kind of funny, so... Looking forward to getting that. Be sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. And share if you would. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in.